Hello everyone, this is BCS Buster, and welcome back to Let's Play Wing Commander 3. Last time we just got around the ship a little bit, and uh, figured out what our, uh, just kind of talked to some people and all that stuff. For now, we're ready to do our first mission. Here we go. Ah, Command Colonel. Time to put that reputation of yours to the test. Confed intelligence tells us that the Karathi presence is growing here in the Osini system. You and your wingman are to fly a routine patrol of these three zones, sweep the area of any hostiles you may encounter. Understood? Completely. So, these are the mission objectives. Oh, and one last thing. Now we get to pick our wingman, so we're just going to, uh, you know, once again, same as before, he's just hanging out, you put the cursor over him, and he's like, oh, he's looking at me. Ops, you're on my wing for this one. Dismissed, and good luck. So I don't know why it takes all those guys just to have two people fly the mission. I don't know. Okay, so before we talk to Rachel, let me show you this real quick. Here's the main terminal. Now we're going to enter our call sign. Now in, uh... Future Wing Commander games, uh, he's referred to as Maverick. So we're going to use that. And you just type it in. Okay. And from here, you can save your game, and we'll save our game. BCS. So, yeah. You can do that. Most of my saving I'll do off screen. And there's the controls, so you can, uh, you know, do whatever you need to do. And we're going to log off there. Okay. Great. Now let's talk to Rachel. Chief Tech Rachel Coriolis, welcome to the Victory Colonel. Heard you're flying with Hobbs on this lane. Hey, you got a problem with that, Chief? No, sir, not at all. I think it's about time that cat's one hell of a pilot. Here she is, one Hellcat 5. She's prepped, primed, loaded, locked, and ready to kick some ass. Thanks. What about ordnance? It's all taken care of. The captain downloads the mission specs to me. I dope out the weapons requirements, so you're set to go. Uh, oh, yeah? In the future, Colonel, you have the option of choosing your own weapons. Or you can trust my judgment and fly with my default loadout. I promise, Colonel, never to disappoint. All right. So we have two hotties on the ship. Excellent. All right. Well, let's do it. It's time for our first mission. All right, here we go. And let's get full speed. Now we're going to push F1 here because I like this view the best. And we're going to push the C button to get communications and then full guns. Okay, I'll explain more about the controls as we go on. Aha, there's the enemy craft. So we're going to lock onto the target there. And now we're just going to wait for him to come to us. Now we have six missiles, and uh, we really, there's only a few enemies in this one. So, we're going to fire a missile, switch to the next target, fire another missile. Just like that, we got both of them. Man, I got lucky. It's two good shots there. Okay, good job. Now we push the A button and we auto on to the next, to the next destination, to our next waypoint. He said we had to patrol three zones, so there's nothing here in the second zone. So let's go to the third zone. All right. Ah, what do we got here? More darkness. Now, these are just, you know, very, very, very light fighters. They're the Kilrathi's weakest ships. So one missile will take them out, and not very many gunshots will take them out, too. So wait till the green Daryl comes up. There we go. Nice. Now, not all enemies are that easy, but... Again, this is the first mission, so... Plus, the guns on this thing suck, so I didn't really want to use them. All right, great. Now we want to log on to the Victory. We need clearance to land. Need clearance, TCS Victory. Oh, excellent work, Colonel. I can see now that your reputation is well deserved. Here's the landing, Colonel. Okay. And just like that, first mission is complete. Hobbs even gave us an impressive shot. Awesome. Pretty 
slick flying, sir. Thanks, Chief. All right, nice job. So let's go back up here, see what's going on. There's Ho or there's Blair. Same thing. He's just in his uniform now. All right, hey, there's Hobbs again. Let's talk to him. Congratulations, old friend. <laughs> just like old times, huh? I must say, it certainly felt good to be back out there again. My gratitude, your trust in me, is endless. Ah, forget it, Hobbs. You're back where you belong now. All right. And okay. Now, after each mission, you can go onto the lift here and um, go up to each of those living levels again and see if there's any new folks. Hey, there's a new guy for us to hang out with. Looks like he's jamming out on a guitar there. Yeah, that's nice. Oh, oh, good day, sir. Patty is Lieutenant Carrier. Sorry, sir. It's Raquel from the Celeste system. You can tell a lot about a system from its music, you know? Some places it's all minor chords. Makes you just want to run out and do a suicide mission. But this is bright. Heat your blood, makes you want to live a long life. Now, are you a pilot, Lieutenant? Or a musician? Oh, I'm a pilot, sir. Pretty good one, too. Check my kill scores. But my family, they make guitars for many generations. I've got one that's almost 200 years old. Sound just keeps getting richer. Someday, I'm going to open a cantina, bring in the best to play that guitar. Place for old fighter jacks like you and me. Well, you better line up some other customers. Might not be many of us left. Oh, yeah. It'll be open to one and all. And me, I'll just sit back, gaze at the beautiful women, and listen to the music. Sounds good to me. He's not focused. Huh. Sounds good to me. That definitely sounds good. It's a nice dream, Piccato. Hang on to it. You bet, sir. <laughs> some of these guys, they actually like the killing. Me? I'll just walk away when this is all over. That's a nice little groove he's got going on there. Let us check his skills, kill scores. Hey, he's only got eight. That's not that impressive. All right, let's see what's going on here. Ooh. It's interesting music, too. Ooh, Ugh. that can't be good. It's time we talk, Lieutenant. Ain't much to talk about, sir. You've flown with it, and you both got the job done. If you're referring to Hobbs... I can't fly with him, sir. If you stay on this ship, you'll have to sooner or later. Don't put me in a position of having to defend him. I won't do it. Why? Let's just say I'm hardwired that way. And nothing you do is gonna change that. Look... I'll try and keep you two separate on offensive assignments. I'm not asking for special favors. We need every good pilot we've got. And just so you know, I trust Hobbs with my life. That's your choice. Dang. Cobra's got some real hatred for the kill Rafi there. She just sits and sharpens her knife all day long. Remind me never to mess with her. All right. Check for the bridge level there. Anybody there? You can just push the tab button around. Uh, nope, doesn't look like there's anyone there. Okay. And no one there, too. Okay. All that's left to do now is head back and to the flight level and do our next mission. But I'm running short of time, so I'm going to go ahead and stop here. Next time, we will get into the next mission and continue on with the story. Until then, this is BCS Buster signing off. Take care, y'all.